it's really bright okay i've not been feeling 100 percent today hence the whole not dressing up thing um the thing is i've seen a lot all over internet um not just on whatever but um where people do these acts of kindness and although i have no issue get that out there right now i have no issue with people doing these random acts of kindness and helping other people no issue with that what i have an issue with is ha doing these random acts of kindness and then plastering their stories all over the internet it's almost like oh look at me i'm a saint and that's really bright you know i've done this really nice thing i've helped this really poor person or i've helped this random person do something really lovely for them and especially if it involves somebody else who's been mean to them first so this person was really horrible to this person and though i i stepped in and i helped them and i'm like okay well thank you well done that's great that's that's lovely you know you did a great thing there but why do you feel the need to plaster that all over the internet what's the reason for it what's it, there, there's got to be a reason why you feel the need to do that is doing a good deed not enough for you that you need validation a pat on the back the whole world to validate you and congratulate you and make you feel like you're a hero or a heroine for being nice to people and for doing something kind and incredibly you know selfless why is it necessary to do something selfless and then tell the whole world how selfless you were it's okay to be selfless it's okay to do a, a random act of kindness it's okay to help somebody who's in trouble but why do you need an audience it bugs me a bit And when I put a comment up on this latest person's feed, their story about a blind man dropping money and how somebody picked it up and ran and they had a go at them for it and told them to leave the shop because blah, 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 blah. They didn't give the money back, so they left. And so they were so kind and gave them their money back out of their own pocket. But for being so selfless, they then posted their story all over the internet. When I queried, well, I didn't really query, I outright suggested that for a random act of kindness to be all over the internet, you were looking for validation and a pat on the back. And for millions of people to congratulate you is rather selfish and not really an act of kindness is just doing something for something you, you you can't do a random act of kindness you can't be that selfless and then go look at me i'm i'm a saint i did this amazing thing now shower me with praise come on i'm waiting waiting for all your praise come on congratulate me i did this such a wonderful thing I, I i i was so selfless i helped these people i gave these people money they were poor i gave them money this person had a bad time i gave them money oh i really helped this person buy their shopping I, I bought this person shopping because they didn't have enough and they had children to feed so i bought their shopping and i've told you all about it so come on shower me with praise tell me how good i am how amazing i am come on congratulate me because obviously i need you to congratulate me because i've told you how great i am and how kind i am and how amazing i am because i'm so selfless that i did this thing 
So now you've got to praise me and you've got to shower me with congratulations and tell me how kind and selfless and amazing and how God is on my side and how godly I am. Correct me if I'm wrong, but that doesn't make it an act of kindness. That doesn't make you selfless. That makes you narcissistic, possibly. If you're looking for congratulations, validation and self and praise from the whole world for doing something nice for somebody else, that doesn't make it kind. That makes it that that that's pride that that is sociopathic almost but it's not a random act of kindness that's you wanting validation praise congratulations from the whole world because you feel that you deserve to be a hero in your own right and this is how you're going to get to be a hero you want the world to praise you for everything you do praise you for your kindness and your selflessness that's not being selfish. It's not. It's being selfish. It's being narcissistic almost. And it's definitely being slightly sociopathic. You can't be kind and then expect the whole world to praise you, congratulate you and treat you like a hero. If those were true acts of kindness, why do you feel the need to tell the world? See, because true acts like that usually go unseen true random acts of kindness like that that these people post all over the internet either whether they write out their story or film their stories oh my days the amount of times people film it film their random acts of kindness for the whole world to praise them congratulate them and tell them how incredible they are treat them like heroes and heroines and superheroes you're not you're just boasting you set up a scenario so that you could boast about it that's pride that's sociopathic it could be classed as almost psychopathic if you're in the right mind frame but you can't class it as a random act of kindness because it's not it's not random there's nothing random about it because those types of things they go unseen unheard and they just happen and then you go about your day knowing that you've done something incredible and amazing for someone. <laughs> and you know, you don't need the world to know it, but you know it. And you knowing that and them knowing that is enough. It's always enough. But if the whole world needs to see it, and hear about it it's never a random act of, of, of violence never a random act of kindness it's planned it's executed so that they can get the praise and the congratulations and the whatevers from the whole world huh. Do not believe everything somebody puts up on the internet. 
is because they're telling a story about how a random person did this for to them. Oh, this random person just appeared and I helped them. It was incredible. It was amazing. It was such a random act of kindness. No, it wasn't. You planned, you executed, you did it. You told the whole world so the whole world could validate you. The whole world could praise you. The whole world could heap congratulations all over you and treat you like the hero you want to be. Because if that was random and if that was real and if that was something that happened out of the blue, you would not feel the need to tell the entire world because you would feel amazing and you would sit there and go, do you know what, that was incredible. Somebody else would feel incredibly amazed at what you did and they would be so thankful for what you did that that would be enough for you if it was real. The person you helped would be so grateful that that would be enough for you. You wouldn't need the whole world to validate your feelings over a random act of kindness. That's if it was really random and if it was really an act of kindness. Take care.